have been days of eager anticipation prior to this massive clash. But now we need talk about it no more and instead focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle no matter who you support. Comprehensive coverage coming up live on EA TV. A warm welcome from one of the newer venues here in the football mad capital of England. We're at the London Stadium. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's West Ham United versus Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And a look at the West Ham 11. Alphonse Areola between the posts. Vladimir Tsofal starts with Emerson in the fullback positions. James Ward-Prowse plays alongside Edison Alvarez in the centre of midfield. And the striker today is Mikel Antonio. The lineup for Manchester United. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Scott McTominay starts alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Jared Bowen. Tomasz Socek. Back to Paqueta. Really good build up, but no end product. Anthony. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes has it. Here's Luke Shaw. Moving the ball more than decently, but can they take the lead? And options in the centre. Looking for someone to play it to. Will it open up? To put them ahead. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Vladimir Tsofal. Edson Alvarez. The ball with James Ward Prowse. Antonio. Paqueta. What can the Hammers do from this position? Ward Prowse. Alvarez. And a chance to whip it in here. Has someone to play it to. Well, this could really help the cause. And still looking for space. And the danger is averted. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Diogo Dallo. Maguire. Good physical play. Sofian Amrabat. It's with McTominay. Will he play it in?
Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. And that brings to an end the first half here at the London Stadium. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Bruno Fernandes has it. McTominay. Could be! Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Is this the moment? And it's in for Manchester United. They are on a victory course. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Number 28, Thomas Sauchek, to be replaced by number 28. Edson Alvarez. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Jared Bowen. A very timely interception. Bruno Fernandes has it. Scott McTominay. Here's Luke Shaw. So a half an hour remaining. Edson Alvarez. In possession, Bowen. Of possibilities inside the box. Scott McTominay. Credit to them for winning back possession. Into the final 20 minutes. Ward Prowse. He's going forward well here. Paqueta. And they could get one back here. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top class reaction from a top class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. And United will switch things around personnel wise. And short it is. Textbook defending inside the box. Scott McTominay. Here's Luke Shaw. It's with McTominay. Return to Rashford. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Antonio, on to Ward Prowse. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. 
Well, nearly there. This game almost over. And looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear to me to be more than a bit gutted. Well, there are two main reasons why they're losing this game. Firstly, they've not shown enough desire to close the opposition down. And secondly, they haven't defended their box well enough. It's been a poor defensive display. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Ward-Prowse. Manchester United recovering possession well. Rashford. McTominay. Can he take advantage? He'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge. And that is going to be that. The referee blows the whistle and it brings this game to an end. Disappointment, you've got to say, for West Ham. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals.